Know what you're capable of swimming 3.8 Ks or 1.9 Ks for a 70.3. Now, we're not saying you should go out every week and swim 3.8 Ks at race pace to know what you're capable of, but you should do some tests of uh, 800 meters or 1,000 meters or 1,500 meters at your chosen race effort so that you know what it feels like, you know what too fast feels like and what too slow feels like. Ideally, you do at least some of these tests in the conditions that you're gonna have on race day, such as the lake or ocean that you're gonna race in. And the most open water swim venues will have a marked horse or marked boy that they know the distance of, and you can time yourself and see what pace you're capable of. And on that note, it's worth pointing out that just because you tapered and fresh on race day, it doesn't mean you're gonna be able to swim minutes faster than you did in training. While you may go a few seconds faster, what you swim in training will dictate the pace that you're capable of on race day. So don't get carried away at the start of that Ironman swim.